And now, your Norcast weather update. Brought to you by Montreal Beach Resort. Under new ownership, discover some of the amazing updates that have gone into one of Cape May's most iconic properties. And check out Harry's Ocean Bar and Grill with an all-new menu and seven days of entertainment, including dueling pianos. Book your getaway or visit today. And good Saturday morning. I'm meteorologist Bobby Clark with an update on your forecast. Appreciate you joining me this morning. Clouds will continue to build out there and filter out there, so we'll have mostly, most, partly to mostly cloudy, we'll call it for the rest of today. There is a risk of a pop-up shower or storm, I think as we head later on in this afternoon, on into the evening, but nothing widespread, nothing organized out there. Just kind of keep your eye to the sky. Sunday, we're going to continue to be mostly cloudy. A better chance of seeing a shower or storm as we head into the later afternoon. And Monday, there it's the most, I think, organized of the rainfall that we can expect, and we certainly can use it as we are very dry out there, but we'll talk about that in just a few moments. Taking a look at temperatures across the area, moving up just a bit as that sunshine continues to build, and we'll have ourselves with those clouds filtering the sunshine later on, but the temperatures should get up into the mid to upper 80s across most of the inland sections, and of course 70s as you head towards the shoreline. Exclusive Norcast hour by hour forecast for the rest of today. Again, clouds building here and there throughout the rest of today. Temperatures getting back into the mid to upper 80s, but what you will notice most, I think, is how it feels out there as the mugginess and that humidity is starting to creep up once again with that system down to our south. Tonight, we'll call it mostly cloudy. Could see a spot shower out there and also some daybreak fog as you head towards tomorrow morning. Temperatures, as you can see, not really going much far in the upper 60s to near 70. Again, feeling muggy because we'll have that east to southeasterly flow out there. As for your Sunday, temperatures in the mid to uh, upper 80s again and 70s along the shoreline. Mostly cloudy skies, a better risk of seeing a shower or storm, especially as you head into the later afternoon on into the evening hours itself. Futurecast, right now we're not seeing too much in the way of cloud cover, but we'll continue to see it push in here on and off throughout the day. So it depends on how much sunshine we can get. We'll determine how, how, how high our temperatures are going to get, especially on the inland areas. As we head into tomorrow, again, cloudiness continues here. Could see some patchy fog as we head into the shoreline itself throughout the day because that east to southeasterly flow with a better chance of seeing maybe a shower or storm pushing in as we head into the evening hours on, especially on into Monday where we can see the most of the bulk of the rain that we can expect. Temperature forecast for after, after next weekend looking like it's going to be on the warmer side, about 10 to 15 degrees above normal. So going back into that hot pattern as we head into the end of next week. Speaking of your seven-day forecast, Monday you got ourselves the showers and storms will continue throughout the day with a lesser chance on Tuesday as that system pushes on out of here. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday looking dry but on the warmer side and as you look at your exclusive Norcast plus three days, showers and storms into Sunday and Monday. Have a great day everybody. See you at lunch.